what's up welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is bianca you should definitely subscribe and stick around i realized i started this vlog and just like started vlogging and never introed it so i just wanted to intro it really quick and then now we'll get into the rest of the vlog i don't know what i was thinking it's like baby brain is hitting me hard just wanted to give you guys a quick little intro to the vlog i'm happy you're here <laughs> just continue with all those clips that i got well, we were just playing ball and I broke a nail, so it looks like we're gonna have to make a nail appointment because Christmas is next week. Can't believe you just did that to me. Okay, so we are opening up another home delivery. Colin told me to stop buying home decor, but I bought this before he told me that, so. what I did like decor wise in just a second I'm sitting on the couch right now Colin just left to go run to his parents house um he had a couple packages that were delivered there that he needs for work and some checks and stuff like that oh my god I'm so tired today I wish you guys could I mean I guess I could show you outside but it has been pouring for hours like non-stop it is such a gloomy disgusting day outside today and it is definitely like affecting my mood i am not motivated and i'm tired i wanted to organize my closet today but that's not gonna happen well maybe it will who knows it's only five today is the last day of my second trimester i'm in my third trimester tomorrow which is so crazy to me i'm wearing like all black right now so you can barely see i don't think you can see at all see her no you can't <laughs> it's just like it blends in there that's a little bit better but anyways yeah it is so gloomy outside today it's so dreary i got coffee and i'm still tired okay so by the way really quick before i forget i'm wearing um a sport body like full body jumpsuit oh so here's my last bump update at 27 weeks and then this is just a very old h&m cardigan but i'm obsessed with it i love this setup that we have and then we're gonna do the gallery wall right here and i think that it's gonna look so good no makeup day for me today except we might be going out to eat for colin's birthday tonight with his parents um like a little delayed birthday dinner so i don't know but if we do i'm still gonna wear this <laughs> so i would just throw on just like literally a little bit of makeup this is the face of a dog who knows we're about to leave and go somewhere ah stop I have to show them daddy's brooch look guys this is what i got colin for his birthday it's hard because i feel bad for colin his birthday is literally so close to christmas so you know anyway we got him a brooch, I paid for it, you know, not sponsored, but we do love our brooches. So he got a black one, so we are twinning with the brooches. Also, I guess here's a little update on the counter storage. My pink brooch is over there. Um, I have this vase here. I guess I'll just show you guys really quick. Murphy's literally gonna hate me. Oh, here's what our nursery looks like at the moment. All the lights are over there. All this is nursery things. My dad is taking those bar stools. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get rid of those nightstands eventually. And those lamps and that plant. It's like every time I come in here, I see more stuff. This chair needs a home and I'm not getting rid of it. This, um... Clothing rack is probably going to end up staying in here and just going somewhere. <laughs> I don't know where. Plant probably for in here. And then this is what I wanted to show you guys. So let's take this out here. Okay, so I really want to bring this into here, but get rid of these. These are like literally from Amazon and they're so, they're terrible. But get um, faux like eucalyptus and put it in there. So I'm just going to leave that in there so I remind myself <laughs> to do that. Yeah, these are fun, aren't they? Okay, let's go crazy. But that's the plan for that. 
Also, I feel like I got nothing done today, but that's okay because whatever, who cares? I'll just be more productive tomorrow. But now um, we decided to not go out to dinner, but just to go over to Colin's parents' house for dinner and celebrate Colin's birthday and like order pizza and stuff. So I'm about to head over there with this one and we're gonna go do that. So um, I might pick up the vlog when we get back, but if not, we'll just pick it up again tomorrow morning for our nice Sunday. Have you ever seen a more handsome dog in your entire life who smiles? <laughs> Are you, is your lip stuck? Oh, now you're just gonna smile. Okay. Good morning, happy Sunday. I am 28 weeks today, you guys. We're officially in the third trimester, which is technically not the last trimester, but it's the last trimester before the baby comes, so. Here she is, 28 weeks. Just get all natural. She's moving. I'm gonna do a second trimester update video, so definitely watch out on Instagram because I'm gonna ask for you guys to submit questions in a little question box on stories. My next appointment's on the 27th, and I don't think I mentioned this in the vlog where I went to the OB for my glucose test, but now I start going to the OB every two weeks. That's on that. I'm about to run to the grocery store because I'm gonna make a breakfast casserole this morning. You wanna show the vlog your new birthday tennis shoes? Yeah. You got a pair of nobles. Is this your first pair? Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is the shoe that we run in mm -hmm. and work out in. It's the Knit Runners, but his has black camo. Mine has like beige on the bottom, so we're pretty much matching, but very cute. My breakfast casserole is in the oven. So my parents usually make it, like my mom or my dad. But um, I wanna learn how to make it because it's my favorite breakfast thing. And honestly, I don't know why it's taken me this long to ask them for the recipe and learn how to make it. I got a package and I did not order this from Solly Baby, Solly Baby. I think it's Solly, I don't know what it is, but I did not order it and I don't think someone bought it off my registry, so I think somehow they got my address and they sent it to me because I've never like been in contact with them like on Instagram or stuff because sometimes brands will message you on Instagram and say like, hey, we would love to send you something, blah, 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 but they've never messaged me, so this is such a surprise and I'm so excited. Okay, so they sent the swaddle, the sleeper, the sleeper, and oh my God, they sent so much. <gasps> a wrap? Oh my god, wait, this is cute, Colin. You would like this color too. You would wear that. Yeah. Where, like, this is what you wrap your her in and you wrap her to you? Mm-hmm. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Oh, they sent a brown one too. Oh my goodness. Wait, this is so exciting. Wait. Okay, I'm gonna take a picture. So, I wanted to show you guys and open up these Sully Baby sleeper things for a piece chilling outside um but look at the, our table there's cords galore so i just got one of my baskets um where is this even from i feel like this is from target maybe i don't know um in our first apartment that we moved to like the first one where colin and i ever lived together the first apartment we lived in was in waverly it was called the sawyer providence farm those are like very expensive now though i've noticed um because they made it like a whole gated community and things. The first apartment we lived in, I literally bought so many baskets, so now we just have them all left over. But I'm going to leave this out because I need it. I'm gonna get them organized and out of the way because I, I don't know. I just, I think I'm in nesting phase already, which I feel like that's normal by your third trimester. I just want everything to be perfect and put away and clean and organized and I want everything to have a spot because that's usually how I am. I think the thing that got me in the last apartment, also I'm touching all of Colin's cords so I feel like I need to be very careful. 
I kind of just like gave up on the last apartment. Like I knew we were moving. I honestly like the apartment itself was really pretty, but I just, you guys know, I just didn't like where we lived. And so I was like, I don't want to put anything on the walls cause we're moving. Like I just don't even want to decorate the space. And then this space, I'm like, wow, I cannot wait to decorate. So I'm just feeling way more motivated to make it a home. Maybe because we're having a baby in this apartment, but I don't know. I just put this basket in the corner though. We have our table, which this isn't gonna end up staying here. I need to find that at home, probably on the coffee table somewhere. I wanna decorate the coffee table too. Um, I ordered a black vase type thing, like a elevated bowl on a pedestal kind of thing so that's gonna go there plus i have some extra decor back here and i'm probably gonna end up putting that on there also the whole coffee table needs to slide over a little bit and we still need a rug but anyways the cords are just in that bin now in the corner and i think that that's really efficient he is so cute so the solly baby packaging is so cute look at this I also need to change my camera battery, so I'm gonna do that. And then I saved this card because it's an uh, instruction manual on how to use the wraps, so I'm gonna save this for when she comes. Okay, so let's open the swaddle first. And what are these, though? Okay, these are wraps, that's right, I forgot. Okay, so here's a swaddle. Look at how cute this print is, too. Oh my goodness, I'll try and um, find all these on the website with the exact prints so i can link them down below obviously this is just going to be like a very big <laughs> cloth but more so i just wanted to show you guys the print because i think that this is adorable so i'm very excited to use this um i'm still on the hunt to find a baby like changing table that's next on my list so this is the sleeper it's a two-piece sleep set Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Oh my goodness, this is not what I thought it was gonna be, but now I'm even more excited because this is adorable. And here's the, her little pants. I'm so sorry. Murphy, your little sissy's gonna wear this. Isn't it so cute? It's funny because people are like, how has your mindset changed from like when you first found out you were literally terrified to be a mom? And I will say like, I think my whole mindset Obviously my whole mindset has shifted and now we're so so excited But at the end of the day like the baby was planned like we always planned to be parents. We always planned to have a baby We always planned To have a girl hopefully so it's just like did she come a little earlier than expected? Absolutely, but was she like Planned yes, like it, you just kind of have to switch your mindset to well We wanted kids and we wanted them eventually and God wanted us to have a baby now so we're gonna have her now and we're just gonna rearrange our like thought process and like she was planned like we've always wanted her you know what i mean we just like the time at, when we thought we wanted her was different than when god wanted her so that's the only difference in my opinion now and we're so excited okay here's another one so if you found out you're pregnant and you weren't expecting it but you wanted to be a mom one day then it was planned and i don't like telling people anymore that our pregnancy wasn't planned because i mean it was like we we did plan to have a baby okay here's the other one this color is adorable too colin's gonna love this he loves colors like this and then this same little footy pants so yeah i mean was it shocking yes but it's what we wanted eventually so can't argue with the big man upstairs, you know what I mean? It's a wrap. Okay, again, it's gonna be a big um, thing of cloth, but literally, I can't even begin to describe to you guys how soft this is too. I cannot wait. I'm probably gonna leave the other one in its case because it's like folded nicely and I like the way that it looks. But, oh my God, I'm literally so excited. So, thank you, Solly Baby, or Solly, someone tell me how to say it. If you are watching this, I'm literally so grateful and uh, I'm still leaving all of my things from you guys that I currently have on my registry on my registry because I feel like you cannot have enough of this stuff. It's so soft and I can't wait to snuggle up baby girl in it. Oh my God. Okay, cute. Okay, also I'm pretty sure my casserole is gonna be done in three minutes. So let's go get it. So essentially you put 
a layer of hash browns on the bottom so you can just go get the cube hash browns from Trader Joe's and you just layer them and then you do a bag of um, cheddar cheese just one bag so like two cups is usually in a bag and then you mix together seven eggs a cup of milk and um, some salt and pepper and then also you put in a half teaspoon of ground mustard in and you mix all that together so the eggs the milk the mustard the salt and the pepper and then you get shredded ham so three-fourths of I got just got boar's head the ham that's in the like cubed ham not like a block of ham like one that can be shredded and just ask them like shredded three-fourths of a pound of ham so you do hash browns cheese and then the shredded ham layer all that and then you guys saw me pour in the egg mixture that i mixed separately on top then you just bake it at 350 for an hour and it's also really good if you do cinnamon rolls and i have cinnamon rolls but since colin's not going to be here to eat it with me <laughs> this was just a test run um i always get these from trader joe's but um yeah this is a test run because i'm going to make it christmas morning with colin's family so just making sure I know how to make it. Um, popped it back in the oven because if you take it out after you're done cooking it and uncover it and you stick your knife in and it doesn't come out solid, like clean, like you don't, you stick your knife in, it needs to come out clean, not runny. And if that happens, just pop it back in the oven uncovered. Um, I had to pop it back in for like 25 minutes actually. So little tip. Don't forget that part because I kind of forgot to tell you guys to do that. It, actually, though, I'm really proud of myself because it 100% looks normal to me. So. Oh, jeez. Okay, here's what it looks like. Such a family tradition. We would have this on every holiday and for my birthday, so. I'm glad I can make it now. And then when baby girl has a birthday and she can eat real food, I can make her this if she likes it. If she doesn't like it, I'll be devastated. Okay, really quick taste test. And then gotta do some work for this while I eat. It looks good. Mm-hmm. Tastes perfect. Look at Mr. Handsome. <laughs> I just made myself this. We're watching Home Alone. I'm gonna put it into a bowl and get comfy on the couch. I just spent the last two hours. Mm, I was placing my hand like this on my cheek. That's why it looks like that. That's cute. Making TikToks. He wants my carrot. So I did start organizing my closet. I got everything put away into drawers. These two huge boxes in that bag are just like sweatpants, sweatshirts, athleisure clothes. I'm sure some clothes are in there that need to be hung up. But it's just like, because there's no shelving or anything, there's just the two, goodness, no, oh my god, there's just the two like hanging racks. I just don't know how to organize them. So if you have any ideas or any links to anything like good that I could get and like help me organize, please let me know. Like I feel like something else could go under there for like organization. Good morning you guys. We are up so early this morning because this is my last week of nannying. Here's my little bump. So it's Monday morning. First day of being 28 weeks pregnant. So well, I guess it's actually my second, but um, I'm just wearing Lululemon lime leggings in this really old, like, green color that I've had forever. They're just the regular length, but tell me, are the high-waisted or, like, the super high-rise Lululemon lime leggings worth it? Because I think that I might order a pair, like, today. <laughs> I think that I might try them. So, I guess you can tell me after I order them, and I'll see for myself. And then this is just a set active tank top. Um... So yeah, usually, I don't know, I can't tell if my outfits are cuter when the tank top's on there, but I think that it's cuter when it's up here. So, anyway, I'm going to work out, taking a 7.30 class. 
Um, I live a little bit farther away from my orange theory now, so I kind of have to leave like way earlier than I used to. I literally used to live five minutes, so that was nice, but it's okay. And then this oversized sweatshirt's from Princess Polly, but it's like literally perfect for the um it's old too. I don't know if they still have it, but if they do, I will obviously like it. Um anyway, and then I'm gonna make sure I order a smoothie before I go into my workout. So that way when I'm done, I can just grab it. And then we are going straight to Nanny. This is, I'm pretty sure, this is my last week Nanny. And I'm just going Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday because then it's Christmas Eve. So yeah, we're doing that this morning. I'm all ready for my workout. trying to get into a car handles which again we know he didn't have a car and so when i hear that it makes me kind of think all right guys look who i have with me it is so cold murph and i are going around errands and murphy's coming because they're doing like a ton of construction and he just like it's just on this one area it's gonna be done today we got an email about it but it's just really loud because they're like tearing up a road to repave it and he's just super bothered like every four seconds he hears something and he's like, what's that? And then he like will settle down and then he hears something else and then he's like affected again. So I was gonna run to Target, but I was like, whatever, I'll just bring him with me. So we are running to Target. Hold on, I'm also trying to fix my hair. I got our gallery wall picture frames from Target. I just did an online order. And that fake eucalyptus I was talking about and a few other things, so. That's exciting. And then I did order prints. I ordered eight five by seven black and white photos that I just went through and chose and picked out. Hopefully tonight when Colin's done with work, he'll be in the mood to help me hang it because I'm trying to get everything like hung up and done that I want to get done before he leaves like the first week of January to go to Georgia for a film. I'm assuming he'll come back and visit on the weekends and stuff, especially because I'm like pregnant, but he's going to miss like I think two doctor's appointments so that kind of sucks but yeah I'm trying to get all the like big things done no 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 I can't even I'm gonna have to fix that okay we just got our online order and holy crap these frames are huge which is good because our wall is huge but no you can't have my fake eucalyptus Look at how good this eucalyptus looks though. This is No, did you just take a leaf off? Oh my god. Hide those. You just killed one of my eucalyptus leaves. He and I are going to have a little play date with his besties from our old apartment. So I'm headed there right now so he can see them. Murph, I'm mom of the year. You just you just don't know it sometimes. I think he knows where we are. I mean, obviously he knows. He's lived here his whole life, pretty much. Murph, where are we? Murphy, where are we? Are you gonna play with your friends? Are your friends about to come out here? Um, I don't know if anyone else can relate to this, but do you see my back window? Hold on. Like, can you see how dirty it is? No, because he just put his head there. My, I've got slobber all over my windows. All over. Every single one. Except for the trunk. Okay, well, we're going to go have a nice play date with his friends. Watch, he knows them by name. Murphy. Do you want to play? Oh, goodness. Do you want to play with Porter? And Brody? Okay. Should we go get Porter and Brody? Do you think so? Are you ready to get out? Was that fun? We just played. It is so, so cold today, and it was 70 degrees Their two days investigation, ago. investigation, like how they never came. Okay, if you haven't started listening to Crime Junkie because of how many times I listened to it in a, a day, it's kind of like funny though, how entertaining. It's so cool. Um, listening to extreme like detail of how someone got murdered. It's like a little messed up if you think about it. Just showered, finally. I'm about to go take my, or if he's exhausted from playing with his friends. I am 
Okay, I'm gonna come in here and put the eucalyptus things in this pot and try it out. Try and, I only got two, but I'm wondering if I should have got three. It's a lot taller than I thought it was gonna be, dang. I can take the tags off too, probably. Maybe I only need two. I don't know, if I feel like I need a third, I can always go back and get another one, but that's really cute. And then, um, my plan is to just get like a tray for here and then move the soap over and put the soap on the tray and maybe like a candle. So, yeah, cause like, you know, decorating threes. I'm about to also put the pictures in the frames, but I just really needed to shower really quick. That's cute, I'm probably gonna just leave the tags on it just to make sure that I like them, but let's go do the frames. Got my frames all laid out. I'll link which frames I ended up going with below. Um, and then here are just some pictures I chose. A lot of wedding photos. Um, this one with the bump. We'll have to update this when baby comes. This one we found out she was a girl. This one we did our announcement photos. Wedding photo, wedding photo. Lots of wedding photos. Cause like, how could you not? And I only could choose between eight. That was like a hard decision. And then of course, had to have Murph in there. So yeah, those are the picks I chose. We'll probably swap them out peri periodically. For how far away like in inches I want the picture frames to be hung he is just so cute and I'm also eating leftover mac but he's just been snoozing there he goes he's gonna fall asleep again and I'm watching Kennedy's vlog so yes here's what we're doing just waiting for dad dad went and got him dog food Dad went and got us ground beef for dinner because I forgot about it. Pregnancy brain. We're just waiting for dad. Is your dog your best friend? Or is it just me? Speaking of best friends, Haven's coming in a few short weeks and she's never even met him. You've never even met Haven. How could we? What did I do before him? Like, do you guys remember when I would complain to the vlog because I was so sad because I just wanted a puppy? Oh, he was so worth it. It's honestly, if you are thinking about getting a dog, this is your sign, right? They need to just get the dog, right? Is that right? Is it true? Oh, see, he has no idea that I'm pregnant. Because, <laughs> Then they you, they just are so cuddly as a puppy. And then when they get big and older, they don't realize that they're big. And they just are still cuddly. So it's great. It's like having a furry, furry man who just loves you. What more could I ask? A furry guy who loves me. So great. So here's dinner. I'm about to pop this in the oven. We're doing linguine. Pasta sauce, oh my god. Indigestion always, just boiled some water. So, <clears throat> starting on that. Murph's dog food. He was out. Oh. Wow, he's so excited to see you. He gets way more excited to see you when you come home than me. I don't get it. Mm -hmm. Here's dinner. Colin told me he's not hanging up our gallery wall tonight, so. I said we can have a lot of fun doing it a different day. Tomorrow. Look at, that is like an unhealthy amount of bread. <laughs> We love our bread here. 
Why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? Oh, dad's gonna get mad at you. Yeah, go hide. Hello, hello. So now we're doing the gallery wall because he wasn't gonna do it yesterday. Makes sense. He worked from 10 to 7. Oh my god, I almost just fell. So we're doing the gallery wall today. It is another cruddy day outside today. Literally, you guys, the weather in North Carolina has been so bad. It's not motivating for anything. My hair is so bad. I need to wash it. So we're hanging up the gallery wall as the last little task in the vlog. Here's my new spacing inspo picture. symmetrically looks bigger on the wall in person like on the camera it looks really tiny but don't you think it looks good mm -hmm. I guess I could have done three rows but I didn't really want to do three rows I think it looks fine and then I'm gonna end up doing like a tall lamp over there so I think it'll end up evening out but there's the gallery wall So I'm gonna end the vlog so I can start a new one, but thank you guys so much for watching. I will have everything in the vlog linked down below as always, and I will see you guys in my next video.